Okay. Dr. Williams, can you get the lights, please? You guys don't have a PowerPoint, or do you? Are you using something? Okay, never mind then. We'll stay off. No, we'll stay off. Just don't click it. Double click it. Okay, the floor is your guys's. Um, do your thing. Alright, um, our product is an anti end quality soft pretzel with chocolate on the inside of the pretzel that you can also heat up in the microwave within seconds. And uh, you need to choose our product. And and, and uh, choose it so because no other product, no other companies really have a product just like ours. There's no soft pretzels that have chocolate on the inside. There's not really even many soft pretzels with chocolate. And also, with an added benefit, you can heat it up in the microwave. Our target market is middle-aged men that watch football because they don't have the time to go out and actually get a quality pretzel from the mall or another store because they're watching the game so they need something for convenience and also the sweet and salty would cater towards the children of the family which would just cause more sales and um we chose our packaging because it is um it's close to what the other packaging of the super pretzel looks like and we put chocolate because i think that's a big part of what we're trying to make and we will sell our product in grocery stores in the frozen food section more densely around football stadiums because there would be more fan base for our product towards our target market. Yeah. Um, like our price for like the um, chocolate pretzel is like three dollars and ten cents because this is like the slightly higher. Than a regular super pretzel due to like the chocolate that's inside of the pretzel. And our competition includes like Auntie's Annie's, Roll Go, Gus's pretzels, us pretzels. They're com they're competitors competitors because of all the all offer pretzel products that people might buy instead of our product. Instead of we test our product among students of the school throughout the school day. Throughout the school day, we choose the market because of the wide variety of people that instead tested our product. And we will begin our product introduction in New York City during football season, advertisement on television, um, local billboard, billboards will be used to attract the attention of football watchers who enjoy hot pretzels but do not attend every game. The use of chocolate may attract a younger audience, younger crowd of football fans. Uh, so, introducing our, you know, chocolate salty, chocolate salty combination, it's all the craze, it's all what we hear about. You got the Take 5 candy bar, you got chocolate dipped pretzels at places such as Auntie Anne's and Gus's Pretzel, and our goal is to turn it around, bring the pretzel to them. For the pretzel is in the home, it's frozen, you open it up, that is our product. We want to start the introduction of the pretzel during football season in New York City. It's New York City, it's a very big pretzel town. Soft pretzels, you know, it's a big thing. In New York City, there's a lot of football fans, a couple football teams. It's a big place to go. You know, it's a great place to, you know, start off our product. You know, just out of the, you know, the test subjects at Herbert High School, we uh, tested last week in this classroom, you know, most feedback we got was positive, very positive. You know, I would like, you know, I would like this. You know, I want to get some more. I want, you know, bring them in tomorrow. You know, you know, Edward loved them. <laughs> <laughs> so, you know, people want the delicious chocolate chip pretzels just as much as they want their favorite team to win the Super Bowl. 
true. You know, everyone wants the pretzels. Everyone wants, you know, everyone wants to see the Rams. Everyone wants to see the Rams get to the top. Well, maybe not everyone. Sorry, Christine. The, the Saints, right? You want the Saints? Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. Tell me, what company are you trying to get to carry this again? Maybe you said that earlier. I just missed it. J and J Snack Foods is okay. the corporation that owns Super Pretzel. Okay. And Super Pretzel is, you know, varieties of, you know, chocolate-filled mini bites. They have. Also, you know, they have a um, hot dog pretzel, you know, some unusual creations they have. We think that the addition of, you know, a chocolate chip inside of a pretzel is uh, something they could, that you could really make some money off. Okay. Is there anything else similar to this in the market right now? Not in a frozen pretzel. There's, you, um, at pretzel, you know, stores at the mall, pretzel vendors, you know, even there, you know, there's not, you know, it's not a big product, but, you know, for the frozen category, which is what we're advertising, you know, you freeze and you, you put them in the oven, the microwave for a few minutes, they're hot and soft and ready to eat. You know, you take them to the couch, you know, watch them while they're watching, eat them while they're watching the game. Okay, and then what, tell me what was your price again? How are you guys pricing it? Three, um, three dollars and ten cents because it's... 40 cents higher than the regular pretzel okay. because we think the chocolate, the added um, chocolate will be more and this is a, This is a box of six of our yeah. pretzels. Okay, so box, three frozen, for frozen, a box of six. Six frozen pretzels inside of the box. Okay, all right. Thanks, guys. Good job.